Okay, this question's number one from December 2013. It's all about time, speed and distance, and it's called Gustav's Swimming Training. It says, uh, Gustav goes to swimming training between 19 and 2030 every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. That's four days. How many hours does he train for in a week? So it's um, four times 1.5 because it's four days at one and a half hours each and that makes six hours. You might want to show where you got 1.5 from. So clearly it's from 1900 to 2030 is 1.5 hours. Um, you might want to write that as 20 and a half minus 19 gives you the one and a half hours times the four makes the six. Question two. Gustav trains in a pool with lanes that are 25 meters long. For his warm-up, he swims 600 metres. How many lanes is that? So that's just uh, 600 divided by 25 makes 24 lanes. Part 3. Your pulse is measured as the number of uh, beats per minute. When Gustav trains, he wants to know his pulse. To uh, quickly calculate his pulse, he counts how many beats he has in 10 seconds. What is Gustav's pulse if he has 31 beats in 10 seconds? So I'm going to my rough paper here and saying 31 beats in 10 seconds, 31 over 10 or divided by 10 beats in one second, and then 60 times that to find out how many beats in one minute. So that works out that uh, it corresponds to 186 beats Per minute, so his pulse is 186. 1 1.4. During training, uh, Gustav swims so fast that he reaches 70 to 75 percent of his maximum pulse. Gustav's maximum pulse is 204. How many beats does Gustav have in 10 seconds if his pulse is 70 to 75 percent of the maximum? Now that's a bit of a tricky question because um, they've given you two numbers there. Do you work it out for 70? Do you work it out for 75? Do you work it out for somewhere in between? What I've chosen to do is work it out for 70 and work it out for 75. So first of all, um, his, um, his number of beats is, um, well, at the lowest, it's going to be 70%. So I've got 70 hundredths of now it's asking you how many beats in 10 seconds so normally the 204 is out of a minute but they're only asking you about 10 seconds so they're only asking you about 10 sixtieths so we've got 70 hundredths 70 percent of 10 sixtieths 10 seconds of the normal maximum pulse of 204 so 70 times 10 times 204 on the top, 100 times 60 on the bottom, comes to 23.8. So that's if it's 70%, but if it's 75% of his maximum, then it's going to be 75 hundredths, 75% 75 of 10 sixtieths, 10 on the top, 60 on the bottom, of his normal maximum pulse of 204, 204 on the top. And that comes to 25.5. So... If um, he's at 70, or between 70 and 75% of his maximum pulse, then that will be between 23.8 and 25.5 beats in 10 seconds. And then the last part, uh, Gustav is considering whether he can swim faster than he normally walks. His best time in the 100 meter crawl is 57.6 seconds and he knows that he normally walks at 5 kilometers per hour. Is Gustav's uh, average speed on the 100 meters crawl faster than 5 kilometers per hour? So what we need to do is work out what that speed is. So 100 meters in 57.6 seconds, what is that in kilometers per hour? So I'm going to my rough paper now and I'm saying OK, 100 metres in 57.6 seconds, so in one second, that's going to be 
100 over 57.6 meters that he can do. But I'd like to know how much he can do in an hour. So I've multiplied by 60 to find out how much he can do in a minute, and then by 60 again to find out how much he can do in an hour. So the number of meters that he can swim in one hour is 60 times 60 times 100 divided by 57.6. And um, we want that in kilometers, so whatever that is, we're going to have to divide by 1,000 to find out how many kilometers in one hour. And that all works out to 6.25. So he can swim at 6.25 kilometers per hour. Um, I've set that out in a slightly neater way here than I've done on the yellow paper. Um, and the question is, um, is his average speed faster than 5 or not? So we need to actually answer the question and not just work out the speed. So we need a little comment there that he can swim faster. There's the answers set out neatly. And there's the marks, 3, 4, 4, 4, 4.